You think you can point to Australia on a map? I think so. My US geography <laughs> teacher would be ashamed. Could you do an impression of an Australian? All right, listen to you, lazy. Crikey, is there a way to see? <laughs> What do you think of Australia as the country? Outback Steakhouse, drop bears or something. Do you have any idea who the leader of Australia is, the prime minister? He shit himself once. What's good y'all, Tristan here, and today we are gonna be asking Americans questions about Australia. So I've been living in Australia for over a year and I just came back to America, so I'm curious on what people think about Australia. I'm filming this video with Joseph Gardner, he has his own YouTube channel, and he's gonna be asking Americans some other questions over at his channel, so I'll link it down in the description. Feel free to go check him out if you wanna see what he's doing over there. What do you think of Australia? First thing that comes to mind. The word <laughs> yeah, they use it a lot there, don't they? Big old island. Big old sunny. island. Sunny. Yeah, sunny. Oh, it's really pretty. Uh, Outback Steakhouse. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Didgeridoos and Wallabies. Yes. Uh, what are they called? Uh, drop bears or something? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, come the get crazy ya. stuff. The wilderness being really dangerous with every animal being able to kill you in a couple seconds. Kangaroos. <laughs> Kangaroos. <laughs> I was going to say, like, they're really happy. Happy? Yeah. What do you think of Australia? Like, first thing that comes to mind. Meth. Meth. Really? No. <laughs> uh, the Great Barrier Reef. Great Barrier Reef. Finding Nemo. What about you? I was going to say koalas. Koalas. Resource rich, water locked, uh, so trade becomes incredibly important to them. Sparse population. Very. Dude, Australia's fucking dope. Um, I want to move there. <laughs> really? I, I was supposed to move there for a year and then COVID happened, but everyone I met from Australia is dope. Like, it just, I love surfing. What do you think of Australians, like the people there? So, fucking wild in the best way possible. They like to have fun. They, they just like to party. They like to go to the bars. They like to get out and get you out. And they like to have you stumbling into the next fun thing. <laughs> I think there's definitely like that stereotype where um, they're known to be hot. <laughs> so like that's definitely all you hear. I think of like models. Models? <laughs> I don't know. Just like awesome people. I just feel like they have a really cool life. I just think of their accent. Their accent? Yeah. Yeah. Do you like it? Yes. <laughs> I think it's cool. I think that Australians uh, are really blunt, despite not being like rude about it. They'll tell you exactly what they're like thinking, uh, but it's never in a mean-spirited way. Like from my time over there, they're really interested in American like politics and things like that, but not necessarily like because. Like, I think it's kind of like they, they want to know that their country is better than ours. Do you have any stereotypes of Australians or Australia? I think of vegans. Vegans? Yeah. <laughs> the weird cross tattoo. The weird cross tattoo? Bogans. Bogans. Yo, you know what bogans are. Good job. <laughs> I do not know what a bogan is. It's like me, but Australian. Okay. It's like an Australian redneck, pretty much. Gotcha. Okay, yeah. <laughs> I feel like they're kind of superior. I don't know why. <laughs> I just guess because they're like off on their own continent, you know, and they just like feel, I feel like they just kind of have it going on. Oh, uh, they they can drink any anyone under the table. Yeah, they like to drink. My, my, I've got some Australian friends, like every other Instagram story is like, oh my God, I'm hung over today. <laughs> Yes. My favorite thing about Australia is that like there's animals that'll kill you, but they just like live in the suburbs, live in the neighborhoods. Yeah. Because that's the impression that I get, that you can just like walk into a suburban home and there's a spider as big as your head. I mean, the stereotypes are going to be, oh, every animal can kill you. <laughs> Every time I've ever met any of them, they're super friendly and they just like to have fun. Oh, yeah. You know, they well, like to party fun. and... Like one time I met this guy and he, he showed me some videos of him like taking shots of beer off people's nut sacks and stuff like that. <laughs> <laughs> like nut crazy. sack shots or whatever they call it. I don't know. It's crazy, but it that was That is some crazy stuff. I do watch it? a lot of Love Island Australia. I have to admit. So, dang, I should have brought that up in the beginning. I watch Love Island Australia. There we go. Do you like it? What do you think? You think they're attractive Australians? <laughs> I mean, it's it's kind of like cookie cutter. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like cookie cutter, like typical whitewash. Also, yeah. it's not demographically like. It's not that diverse. Varying. Yeah, it's not diverse. But yeah. it's, you know, it's trash TV. So it's not like. I'm dissecting it that much. Do you know any Australian slang terms? Um, I know caps. Caps? Yeah, yeah. there we go. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. That's the one. Do you know any Australian slang? Yeah. You do? What are some Australian slang words? Oh, wait. Or phrases? Well, Maccas is one. Maccas? I know that they call, um, like diapers. Nappies, chips, chips, and fries. Big chip girl. 
Australians, they like to think that Americans can't label Australia on a map. No, I bet. Do you think you can? All right, sweet. Here we go. Map of the world. Right there. Right there. Right there. Boom. Boom. Got it. I'm so mad I didn't print this out, but where is Australia? Yeah, Australia's just right there. Boom. Got it right. right, there. right yeah, right there. Right there. Bingo. Right there. Got it. Yeah, it's that one, yeah. right? Yeah, oh, yeah. 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 All right. Yeah. All right, there we go. Okay. Right there. Got it. Right there. Bingo. Wow. So smart. <laughs> Wait, you saw that one? <laughs> no, it's not that Alaska? One. Do you think you can point Australia out on this map? Right there. Boom. Where is Australia? Bingo. Right there. Dude, you got it. Shut up, bitches. Right there. You know where it's on a map? Wait, what? Australia. Yeah. I think so. All right. Yeah. All right. We're going to see. That's Australia. Boom. Got it. Not going to lie. The 100% did surprise me a bit, but hey, guess we do take geography. Would you rather live in the States or Australia? Australia. Australia? Yeah. I think the States. The States? If you asked me last year, Australia. <laughs> <laughs> right now, America. Right now. Nice. <laughs> Great answer. In this political climate? Wherever, yeah. Australia. No, probably f in Australia. Generally. Australia? I would probably still live in America. I'm not the type to really up and leave somewhere i'd rather just visit a bunch of places and come back to where i'm comfortable i've never been to australia so i can't say i would want to live there but i've been to europe and stuff and i would honestly live there if i could i've never traveled over there so i don't know if i can answer that fairly gotcha um but i think it would be cool to live over there because it seems just kind of like you just kind of have a lot of freedom to do whatever the f you want you go out to the outback and just do whatever you want but i love america too so yeah it's, you know could you do an impression of an Australian? All right, listen to you, lazy cunt. <laughs> oh, that is good. That's super good. Holy crap. Thank you. Have you been there before? No. Wow, that's that's impressive. Could you do an Australian impression? Oh, God, no. <laughs> oh, God. Crikey, sir. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Like crikey, man. Crocodile, don't you? Oh, crikey. I can't even down there. Wallaby, didgeridoo, uh, Outback Steakhouse, Great Barrier Reef. New Zealand. Hey, cunt, let's go right over here, mate. Yeah. Go to the jibby and take some shots, drink some Heinekens. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. That's great. Excellent. Could you do an Australian impression? Just a word or two? I mean, not really, mate. <laughs> <laughs> Could you do your best Australian impression? Impression of an Australian? I. No, man. I've, I've seen Crocodile Dundee enough to, like, not. Do that. No, probably not. It would come out really bad and I would be embarrassed about it. Uh, no, I'm not gonna culture it appropriate. No, <laughs> oh, okay. Good. Good, good, good day. Good. Who's the leader or the prime minister of Australia? Ooh. Couldn't tell you. Uh, not the current one. Harper was the last one, right? Not the current. It's not Boris Johnson. No, nope. that's all I can say. No, nope. that's the only person I'm thinking of. No, I don't yeah. know who. Scott Morrison, but Scott no Morrison. one, no one knows it. Actually, I do, but I don't know his name. But I know exactly what he looks like. I watch a lot of Australian news because of all the stuff that was going on here in America, was like the election and just yeah. like all the shenanigans that are going on right now. Look, I actually know this. I don't know. People roast on him a lot. <laughs> yeah, they do. He shit himself once. Rumors started circulating that Scott Morrison, huge Sharks fan, had violently shit his pants at the Engadine Maccas after the Cronulla Sharks lost the 1997 Grand Final. Scott Morrison filled his trousers uh, in the Engadine McDonald's in 1997. And I was going to say... It's not Sydney. It's not Queensland. Brisbane? Not Brisbane. Sydney? Perth. It's not Brisbane. Is it Perth? Okay, it's not Sydney. No. No. It's... What's that place on Nemo? Is it that one? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> what Sydney? is that one? Sydney. Yeah. Yeah. Sydney. No one's gotten it yet. No one's or is it Melbourne? Canberra. I would never have guessed that. Yeah. It's called Canberra. Canberra? Canberra. It's like I've never heard of that. My US geography <laughs> teacher would be ashamed. <laughs> I don't think I was ever taught that. I was, and I forgot. Feel free to let me know what you thought of these responses in the comment section below. About a year ago, I did a video very similar to this where I asked Australians what they thought of America. I have that video linked right over there. Just like in this video, there were some really funny responses. Anyways, y'all, thank you so much for watching. Really appreciate it, and I hope you enjoyed the video. As always, peace out, and I'll see you on the next one.